convicted murderer Alec Murdoch is asking the state for a new trial. His defense team is accusing the Colleton County Clerk of Court of jury tampering. And the South Carolina Law Enforcement Division has investigated the claims. Now the jurors in the case and that clerk of court will be examined in an evidentiary here hearing. And this morning, Ryan Tismaneski joins us in the studio with a look at the allegations being made against Becky Hill. Yeah, Kyle Murdoch's defense team says that Hill tried to influence juror, jurors to rule against Murdoch and that she discussed his testimony and evidence presented in the trial with them, which is strictly not allowed. In court filings, Murdoch's lawyers say they only need to prove that Hill talked to jurors about evidence, not that she swayed their decision. Those filings also claim that they have evidence to support that Hill inappropriately talked to jurors. Their motion concludes that if Hill is found to have tampered with the jury, they believe Murdoch must be granted a new trial. Former South Carolina Supreme Court Justice Jean Toll has ruled that sitting jurors will be examined in the evidentiary hearing as well as Hill herself. Another witness that surely needs to be called because of the allegations made is the clerk of court. You know, she issued, she's given an affidavit denying making any of these statements. She has. When these allegations were first raised, uh, we instructed uh, SLED to do an independent investigation, good, bad, or ugly, and only uh, because of the results of that investigation or is the reason why we're standing here and litigating these issues before your honor. One juror who had scheduling conflicts was examined this past Friday. No cameras were allowed in the courtroom. Now, everyone else will be examined over the next few days. WTOC will be present at these hearings, so stick with us for the latest. Ryan Chismineski, WTOC News. Developing now, President Biden 